Hey guys, so in today's video we have a whole lot of cuteness and we have some cleaning. We got a puppy. That was our big news I talked about in the last video and we are so excited that he's here. He is so adorable. He's a handful but totally worth it. I hope you guys enjoy today's video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and if you're new, please consider subscribing. We'd love to have you as part of the channel family. If you want to skip all the puppy cuteness and get right into cleaning, it's at about the 345 mark. super excited cannot wait to share him with you guys so you can see what he looks like he is so adorable we're still deciding on a name right now hopefully by the time we get home we'll have one for him are you guys excited about going to get our puppy yeah yes how excited <laughs> The flashlight, the blanket, and the man. It's a real adventure, the trail you're looking at. Yes, baby, that's our puppy. I'm glad you came for a while. I thought you might be bailing. Is that the same yellow shirt you used to wear? But a thousand years seem like almost no time now. This guitar right here, do you still remember how? For you, I was crappy, but you sang along and Oh yeah, you tell him So this is Jagger Blue And it is the morning after we got him We got him yesterday afternoon We had a pretty rough night With him trying to adjust not having mama and his siblings but he slept in the crate by my bed, and I spent a lot of time sitting next to the crate trying to calm him down so everyone else could sleep. Hopefully tonight will go a little bit better. It was annoying. It was kind of rough, huh? Yeah. But he's worth it. We've got a Stars got nothing on you. That one's brand new, still, it's got nothing on you. Now that we're through all the puppy cuteness, we'll get into cleaning. But that is Jagger Blue. He's an F1B mini golden doodle. He's so adorable, so easy to care for, and he's learning super fast. He's just such a sweet boy. I'm so glad that we found the breeder and that we got him. So you guys will notice a lot of different clothes, a lot of different lighting. This was a couple day project to film because of puppy. It takes a lot to take care of a puppy. I didn't realize how hard it would be to take care of him and try to film and take care of the boys from homeschool. I definitely have my hands full, but I wouldn't change it for anything. It's been such an awesome experience. Like that. 
another chance Loving you is all I wanted I'm wide open for a love affair Girl, when you're looking like that Closer, closer, I'ma get closer so I am just going to get this cleared out of the way so I can get dinner started. I got a late start today. It's round two. I should have started dinner earlier this morning, but I'll just go ahead and put it on a high setting to get it done. So once I have this done, I'm going to give this poor kitchen some love. It really needs it. It has been just run down by all of us for a couple days. And with the puppy and the boys being out of school, I just have not had the chance to really get in here and take care of things. So now I'm going to get to it. Smiling like that, I could never resist it Smiling like that, I could never resist it Smiling like that, I could never resist it the kids need 20 cups a day and about a million snack bowls. I swear I spend the most of my time doing nothing but their dishes. It's just never ending. It's frustrating. Definitely not the funnest point of my day. I just don't even know what to do anymore. I try to keep an eye on them and then I turn around and there's just a counter full of cups. You are the one that I just need to feel loving. You saved me from the broken house that I built. You took me in with open arms and I still I want you back, back, want you back, back, back Some say that love don't hurt But I've got you stuck in my memory Some say that hearts come first But they've never known what it's like to be In love and 20 years old We kiss in the rain till we catch a cold Some say that love don't hurt But I want you back Cause I got you stuck in my memory If you're looking for new sheet pans, these are awesome. I highly recommend them. They're from Target. They're just Target brand. They also have them in like a silver gray color. I went out and was going to buy them individually and then we found a set of them. And I absolutely love them. Highly, highly recommend. Want you back, back, want you back, back, back. Yeah. I want you back, back, want you back, back, back. Clean kitchen sink and fresh sheets are two of my absolute favorite things. Unfortunately, I do not see the sink clean often enough. I was going to try to get this pantry somewhat organized and looking better, but I just was running out of time. So I'm just going to quickly put everything away and save this for another day. He was needing some attention, so I took a break to play with him. And this is why my house is getting so run down. I just can't help myself. He's just too cute. I 
At this point in the day, I just gave up on homeschooling. I figured we'd pick it up tomorrow. So I am getting this table cleaned off. It's been a couple days since I've seen it, not covered in this ugly tablecloth and covered in school books. It just feels so nice to have it done, have the decorations back on, and be able to eat dinner on it. When you guys are doing homework or homeschooling or any type of studying, where do you guys like to do it at? So I made this little puppy station and it's just going to stay here in the kitchen until he's a bit older and I don't need to grab these things constantly or I'm able to turn my back on him so I can get things for him. It has been so convenient just having it sit here but I, I'm kind of tired of looking at it. So hopefully in the next few months I guess when he's out of his big puppyhood I can get it moved to the pantry and laundry room. floors vacuumed and mopped before I call it night and start again tomorrow. We have a lot of grass everywhere thanks to little puppy. He brings it all in on his fur. He is so short that he rubs the grass with his belly and then of course he likes to lay down and roll around in it and then it comes in on me as well. Something nice about the grade of doodle he is, he won't shed. He will blow his puppy coat and that will be all the shedding he will do in his whole lifetime. So it's really nice. I don't have to worry about having a little fur everywhere, but he sure does drag in a lot of debris. It's such a good ride While we collide It can't be real Yeah, we I want to get the grout in here clean soon It's starting to get more of a grayish tone Than like the whitish cream it's supposed to be I think a lot of it is all the cleaners that I use That just kind of discoloring it But I wanted to ask if you guys had any recommendations I know a lot of people use toilet bowl cleaner, but that kind of worries me because it seems messy and the bleach, if I don't get it all cleaned up, could hurt the boys or the puppy. I've also seen people use carpet cleaner, which I want to try, but I wanted to see if anyone has tried that and if it works really well. Or if you have something different that you just love, please let me know in the comments below. As you can see, I have about four loads of laundry sitting on the couch. This couch, I think, can probably hold up to about 12 loads, but I don't want to test it, so I'm definitely going to get that taken care of, but I'm going to do it in the morning because I am just eat, and I know Puppy's going to have me up to go potty in the middle of the night, so I want to get some sleep. So call me out, call me out, baby.
And here it is the next day, and I'm getting that laundry folded so I can get it put away and get this living room clean. I really hate that the laundry gets out of control like this, but I find that this is the thing that really does always get out of hand for me. I don't know why. Do you guys have any systems that work really well for you so you don't get backed up like this? Yeah, we dance like no one's watching. So call me out, call me out, baby. So call me out, baby. Together we can go crazy. You and me in the night. I am feeling alright. Now I got you where I want. So call me out, baby. Together we can go crazy. The bright side to all this laundry to fold is it gives me a chance to catch up on all the cleaning channels I love to watch on YouTube or to catch up on HGTV. I always love snooping at all the houses or looking at the signs and getting ideas for my house. And then I always realize that uh, I'm not creative like that and I can't put those projects together. watch it while I dust the living room and get everything picked up. The boys are occupied, so the TV is all mine. So call me up, baby. Together we can go crazy. You and me in the night. I'm feeling all right. Now I got you and I want more. I would say the fireplace is my it's least favorite place to dust in the living room because I'm so short I have to stand on top of the hearth and tiptoe and I still can't see up onto the mantle so I'm just assuming it's clean and then I have to do the same thing to get everything back up there and it I don't know that's just not my favorite and I have no idea what was going on with my camera. I'm so sorry. That totally went blurry a couple times and out of focus. It hasn't happened to me before. So odd. Useless words. What you said, what I said, that might have made it worse. We're here again at the same spot where we kissed the first time. I swear my pain is far away, long gone by now. We've got a fire in the tent. It's 5:30 a.m. Let's be the kids who left get in trouble. That is it guys, I'm going to finish up by vacuuming the couch and then I am done for the day. Thank you so much for watching, thank you so much if you're new and coming to check out my channel, I greatly appreciate the support, it means so much to me. And if you are new here and you like the videos, please subscribe, I would love to have you a part of our channel family. I hope you guys have a great week and I will see you next time, bye. It's 5.30 a.m. Let's be the kids who left Get in trouble again That star's got nothing on you That one's brand new Still it's got nothing on you Tonight We've got a fire